joy and one of life's greatest miracles. Love is a miraculous gift that has been given to us, and a wedding is a celebration of that gift. So we are gathered here to share and rejoice with Chad and Lindsay and vow our unconditional love and support to them as they begin a new and magical journey together as husband and wife. Who gives Lindsay to be wedded to Chad? Thank you. Marriage is not entered to be entered into lightly, but reverently, passionately, lovingly, and solemnly. Do you both come of your own free will, soberly, reverently, and without guard? If anybody can show just cause why they may not be joined together, speak now or forever hold your peace. <laughs> just <checking. laughs> I would like to take a moment to recognize all the family members of Chad and Lindsay and to thank them for their love, support, and devotion as they grow into two beautiful individuals who are here before us on this special day. We thank you for teaching them good moral values and for being there to show them the beauty of loving another. This is also a time to celebrate all of those who have touched your lives but are not able to be with us in person today but are here in spirit. We are a part of everyone who has ever loved us and we remember you on this day. Lindsay has asked that I read you this poem for her. Dear Lord, please clear a spot for him. He should have the perfect view. I told you it was going to be hard. His little girl's a bride today, and I'm counting on you. Let me feel his presence as I journey down the aisle, but let me notice his absence, if only for a while. Let me stop to think of him as I am given away and know that if he could, he would be here with me today. Hmm. Dear Lord, please clear a spot for him. You should have the perfect view. And if he should get sad today, dear Lord, I count on you. Devotion, joy, and love can grow only if you nurture them together. Stand fast and hope that and hope and confidence, believing in your shared future just as strongly as you believe in yourselves and in each other today. Only in this spirit can you create a partnership that will strengthen and sustain you all the days of your lives. May your lives always be blessed with love and truth. Now let's get this done. <laughs> Okay, ready? Chad, will you have this woman to be thy wedded wife? To live together in marriage, will you love her, comfort her, honor her in sickness and in health, in sorrow and in joy as long as you both shall live, and forsaking all others, be faithful only to her? <laughs> Lindsay, will you take this man to be your wedded husband to live together in marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor him in sickness and in health? and sorrow and a joy, as long as you both shall live, and forsaking all lovers, be faithful to him. The wedding ring is an outward and visible sign of an inward and spiritual bond which unites two loyal hearts in endless love. It's the seal of the vows of Chad and Lindsay will make each other. Bless these rings, who give them and wear them. May they ever abide in peace and live together in unity, love, and happiness for the rest of their lives. Repeat after me. Lindsay, I give you this ring as a symbol of our vows. With all that I am and all that I have, I honor you. With this ring, I be wed.
Okay, your turn. I give you this ring, Chad. <laughs> this is a symbol of our vows. With all that I am and all that I have, I honor you. With this ring, I be wed. Okay, we have come together near and far to celebrate your lives as individuals and bestow our blessings upon you as you begin your magical journey together as husband and wife. We have come together to witness the creation of a brand new family and to share in the joy of that moment with you. Your marriage will develop a true friendship between the two of you and that friendship must be strong and able to withstand the tests of time. Remember that you are a true friend to someone you want to spend time with them. You want to share with them, care for them when they are sick, spiritually or physically. You want to learn new things with them. You want to change with them. You want to grow in truth with them. And you want to experience all that life has to offer with them. Through this process, you will wind up on the same page together. And that is the secret of having peace and happiness in their lives. Take responsibility for making the other one feel safe and give the highest priority to the tenderness, gentleness, and kindness that your relationship deserves. Never allow anything to be more important than the one you have chosen to spend your life together with. Because Chad and Lindsay have showered our hearts with expressions of your love and promised each other all the joy of all your days before God and this company, it gives me great honor and pleasure to pronounce you as husband and wife. You can kiss your bride. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce you to Dr. and Mrs. Chad Tarnick. <laughs>
Thank you, Mr. Shell. That was lovely.